Hey, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna talk about top 5. Starting at number 5. Nikon Z6 II. The Nikon Z6 reigned as the king of this list for a long time, and while the Z6 II is only a modest successor, it should definitely be on the shortlist of anyone who's looking for a full-frame camera. The Z6 continues to offer great value, but we think the Z6 II is worth the extra cost if you can afford it. It's one of our favorites from our reviewing experience. Its Extra X 6 processor brings a host of improvements, including new 14 frames per second burst mode, up from 12 frames per second on the Z6, and some handy autofocus boosts, particularly for animal eye slash face detection. You also get an extra UHS-2 card slot, which joins the existing XQD slash Express slot. And a firmware update has delivered a new 4K slash 60P video mode. Our tests found in a range of scenarios found that the 24MP full-frame BSI SEMA sensor performs well at high ISOs. The Z6 II also has class-leading build quality that feels more substantial in the hand than its rivals. Full-featured 4K UHD video Top-of-the-line video performance with 4K UHD 60p using full pixel readout and a host of outstanding features. For serious videographers, Subject acquisition with speed and precision. 3. 5x more buffer capacity than the original Z6. Faster continuous shooting. Improved AF performance and functionality. Dual card slots, CF Express slash XQD plus UHS-2 SD. Flexibility and peace of mind when shooting important moments or on assignment, such as wedding and event photography. Comfortable durable, intuitive. Z6 II exterior and interior have been thoughtfully designed to be handled and used with max comfort and ease of operation. Coming at number 4. OM System OM-1. Not everyone need a full-frame camera, and like the Fujifilm X-T4, see no. Two above, the OM System OM. One harnesses the benefits of its smaller sensor to create a compelling alternative for those whose priorities are size, versatility, and a fun handheld experience. Thanks to its new stacked Micro Four Thirds sensor, which is the first of its kind, and a speedy Truepix X processor, the OM-1 performed admirably in most our tests. Quite simply, it's the one of the most enjoyable cameras you can buy. That 20MP resolution also isn't huge for a camera of this price. But if you can overlook those drawbacks, then the OM-1 and its huge range of micro four-thirds lenses will make a fine companion. Cross Quad Pixel AF delivers 1053 point, all cross-type 100% high precision focusing. Trupic X Engine will deliver up to 3x faster processing power. New 20M stacked BSI Live MOS sensor provides amazing resolution and low noise. Computational photography functions, including handheld high residential shot, live North Dakota, handheld live composite, focus stacking and HDR shooting. IP53 for the most extreme conditions, including dust proof, splash proof and freeze proof performance to dash 10 degrees Celsius. At number 3. Canon EOS R6. While the Canon EOS R5 is overkill for most people, the EOS R6 is a more affordable full-frame alternative that is simply one of the best cameras for photography around. If you already own one of Canon's early mirrorless full-framers like the EOS R, or any of its DSLRs, this is a more than worthy upgrade. Based on our review, the EOS R6 brings best-in-class autofocus, a superb in-body image stabilization system, and burst shooting powers that mark it out as a very fine camera for wildlife or sports photography. Despite its ability to shoot 4K slash 60P video, the EOS R6 lacks options like the ability to DCI 4K and we found it to have overheating limitations. Compared to video-focused rivals like the Sony a7S III, making it better suited to stills photographers. 
but for photography, it's an excellent, if pricey, option that delivers hugely impressive autofocus, handling, and features that make it one of the best options around for anyone who needs a full-frame camera. Dual Pixel CMOS AF covering approximate 100% area with 1053 AF areas. Subject tracking of people and animals using deep learning technology. Video capture resolution, 4K UHD 2160p. EOS R6 camera body, battery pack LP E6NH, battery charger LC E6, wide strap. Camera cover RF5. Number 2 of my list. Fujifilm X-T4. It isn't a full-frame camera, but in our review we called the Fujifilm X. T4 the best APS-C camera we've ever tested, and its blend of features. Size and value make it a fine choice for hobbyist shooters. The X-T4 builds on the Fujifilm X-T3's impressive foundation by adding in-body image stabilization IBIS faster burst shooting and some successful design tweaks. Adding to its all-rounder skills are a bigger battery, which keeps it going for 500 shots per charge, and some improved autofocus, which our tests found to be fast and reliable in most scenarios. We think the X-T4's 26MP APS-C sensor is class-leading for stills photography, but the X-T4 is also a superb video camera, the in-body image stabilization IBIS is a big bonus here, and the X. T4 backs that up with a huge range of tools and a great shooting experience, including a fully articulating touchscreen. It might cost the same as some full-frame cameras, but the X-T4 and its fine range of X-series lenses make a great smaller alternative for those looking for a mirrorless all-rounder. For this reason, X. T4 features a newly developed mechanical shutter that is the fastest and most robust in the history of the X-Series. Not only can it make images at 15 frames per second, but it is also rated for 300,000 actuations too. When you combine this with its larger capacity battery that is capable of up to 600 frames per charge too, X. T4 has the power and the durability to give you the peace of mind that you'll never miss the perfect opportunity. Find the best angle for your story. When chasing the perfect image, versatility is key. So the last thing you want is to be hampered by awkward angles. The 1. 62 million pixel variangle touchscreen LCD featured on X. T4 can be adjusted to make it visible from a wide range of positions. This not only gives you a high quality monitor to frame with, but also provides quick and simple controls when you need them most. On the flip side, there are times when you need to minimize the light and distractions that a screen can create. That's why X-T4S LCD has been designed to easily fold away so it is completely hidden from view. Leaving the updated 3. 69 million pixel slash 100 fps electronic viewfinder to help you focus on the moment at hand. And number 1. Sony A7 IV. Following Sony's fantastic A7 III was never going to be easy, but the A7 IV is a worthy successor. Equipped with a new 33MP sensor that's solid for both stills and video. It's a compelling mirrorless option for hybrid shooters. In our review, we called it a brilliant blend of photographic power and video versatility. A price hike does mean it's no longer an entry-level full-frame camera like its forebear but a Bion's XR processor powers solid performance that broadly justifies the extra expenditure. No hybrid camera comes without compromise. There is a heavy crop on 4K footage and it isn't the simplest camera for beginners to use. The Canon EOS R6 also offers faster burst speeds for a similar price. But considering its powerful versatility and higher resolution, the Sony A7 IV deservedly takes our number one spot. The Alpha 7 IV is a truly hybrid camera with both high-resolution 33MP stills and up to 4K 60P video for photo and movie creators, with additional features for live streaming and real-time content sharing. Check out this video description for latest price and more informations. 
Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe and stay tuned.